Greetings, Great Witch here. So we are currently in Armadillo and we are about to pick up another bounty. Let's over here to the board, see which one they got. Let's see what's going on. So this would be my second bounty. This one, we're taking alive. All right, so that one is for people who own a wagon or part of a posse. I am neither of those. So we're gonna do this one. Old Louis James, wanted dead or alive. Okay. He's a swindler and a charlatan. So we're going after this guy. We're going to take him alive. See what the difference in pay is. See what kind of thing goes on. We're bringing him in dead. We got six bucks. Wasn't much. But it really wasn't that hard work. Take this guy alive. It's currently going to be a bit more challenging. So I want to see how much more money we'll make compared. Because I know one thing. They need to increase the pay raise on these bounties. The minimum bounty pay should be at least 25 bucks because I can make 65 bucks for doing the minimum with a trader. So it's not really a good incentive to do bounties. Now I haven't done any of the legendary bounties, so I have no idea how much those pay. But I'm gonna assume that they are also a lot more difficult. So, you know, I don't know. Seems like the trader and the collector are the ones that are going to be the ones that pay out the best. But that is just, I'm only in my second bounty, so who knows? We'll find out. This little area right here is a death trap. I definitely don't want to be caught in this area. I mean, this would be the perfect spot to be ambushed, because you have literally nowhere to go but back. So, don't get caught over here. That'd be bad, 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 bad. Really bad. <laughs> all right, so this dude is all the way up at Rathskeller Fork. That's pretty much all the way up in the corner of the map up here in New Austin. I don't know. It seemed like with the first one, they kind of had like a small army. So I'm kind of assuming that that's going to be the trait. Oh, there's some dude digging in that cemetery right there. Better leave them bones alone. This is spooky season, but there ain't no time to be dootin'. Alright, so... Yeah, like I was saying, like they have like a, a small army. And I'm only assuming that that's gonna get bigger with the legendary bounties, so... I don't know how those are gonna turn out. But I'm interested. I'm gonna pick one of those up soon. I just wanna knock out a few more of these smaller ones. Just to get the, the feel for them. Just to see how it's gonna work. I love doing them in story mode. Story mode was was a pretty good time. So I'm hoping that this is gonna be the same. Like I was saying, the payouts though. Six bucks for a dead guy? It's not really worth going after him. I probably spent more on that in ammo. I mean ammo's pretty cheap, but still. You know, I gotta craft it and all that. It takes time. Let's see if we can save some time here. Things got you wheedly dee and all around the map. So I get up here. Guess I'm gonna have to use the lasso. Now I now do remember in story mode, sometimes the guys would get out. You'd be carrying them along and they'd just like roll right off the back of your thing, like, ah, I'm free. So I'm, just, I'm pretty much sure that's gonna happen again. Because I do know one of the perks that you get for doing this is a, an increased strength lasso. So that ought to be pretty cool to get that. Right, here is the fork. What do we do? Oh, okay, it's up here at this house. Find a scouting spot before the target arrives. And there ain't nothing to hide behind out here. It's nothing but sagebrush and mesquite trees. We're in the desert, man. See if I can find me a spot. There ain't nowhere to, to stand out here without getting spotted. Maybe over here. Oh no. This ain't gonna work. I need like a big boulder or something. Oh, I got a little... Well, there's a wagon. Depends on which way he's coming from. If he's coming from in there, this is cool. But if he's coming from behind me, I'm screwed. Well, let's see. Let me pull out the old binoculars and see where everybody's at in here. Oh, well, let me pull them out. So, let's 
because I'm leaned up against the wall? Pro. Oh, there he is right there. Oh my god, I'm gonna get caught. There he goes. Oh. Locked on the wrong guy. And that dude is running like he is on fire. Cool. Right. I think I winged him. And he's still right. Okie dokie. Yep, that's completely effective. Let's get the horse. This is really not a fast horse, so I hope I can catch this dude. Because he's got a pretty substantial head start. This dude took off like he was on fire. Who's that? That's not him. I don't know who that is. No, it's just a random guy. I hope I can catch up to this dude. He's way up there. I can just barely see him. There he is. Oh, I got you, dude. Let me get out the magic lasso. This one don't make you tell the truth. It just makes you get on the ground. How close I gotta be before I can get... I can't remember how close you had to be. I'm sure they're gonna make it even close. Yeah, look at that. I gotta be way closer. Yeah, let's do a jump so it slows me down. That was awesome. Oh, I got you, dude. You're fixing to get hogtied. Go ahead. Scream your head off. You're miles from where anyone can hear you. Yeah, it's not going to help you. Help! Anybody! You hogtied? Somebody help no one's me. coming to help you, bro. The Ooh, potty mouth, too. Nah, you better be quiet before I hit you on top of the head with my shillelagh. Put you on the horse. Oh, we got bad guys coming. The good thing is, I've only got to take you to Tumbleweed, and you basically drove yourself right there. Come on, get these ropes undone. All right. Oh, yeah, we can go right here. All right, I got this. This is this is cake. Because I am literally just right around the corner from this town. They'll never catch me now. So that was pretty cool. Got this guy. Jesus Christ! Yep, you're busted, dude. There ain't nothing you can do. Damn your eyes! <laughs> so that wasn't too bad. I actually kind of prefer him taking off and running instead of having to fight everybody. So that might be the thing to spook him out and make him run. And then, just chase them down. You ain't got to deal with all those guys in the camp. Uh, I'm going to have to try that a few more times, see how that works. You asshole. Oh, quit being mean. You shouldn't be a swindler. Damn, it's dark in here. That's our bounty. Oh, it's and old dude who doesn't like nobody. The Put them in a cell for me. That's the bounty, as agreed. Cool. All right, well, this is Grey Witch. That's pretty much how that works out. And we're going to end this here, and I will see you next time. Peace.